is the mark of a true Russian Badger supporter. All right, y'all see it. You know what I'm saying? What a banging drink. We got quirked up operator goaded with the swabs. Some CSGO. Never played this game. Maybe. Let's get it though. So when the metal hit his mug, he just sunk in place. 100k holla, chilling Bahamas. Come home to your crib and throw in your mama. What is good, Holla Squad? We are the little squad on the YouTube platform. Listen, today we are back. And we got a video sponsored by Guacamole Gamer Fart 9000. All right? If y'all ain't tasted it, y'all better order it. All right? Listen, I went through one container in like a week and a half. I ain't gonna lie. Sucking that joint dat pause. All right, let's get into the video before I get myself in some trouble. This video was sponsored <laughs> by Guacamole Gamer Fart 9000. Let's roll. They're claiming hiding seat, which means they're in the port of party, which means you open it, I zoo some. Okay. What up, is this a new CSGO? This look a little bit more upgraded than the ones I've seen. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Smitty, prank him, John. Whoa. Prank him. Hey, yeah, I'm gonna no, try. You already know. Prank him, John. <laughs> God, my wife is the greatest. I really love her. Graphics done leveled she up. Is, I oh, oh, yes. Right. My wife is the greatest. I really love her. The first thing I hear. Cringe. <laughs> what the Jeez, watch out. Don't step on that clown horn. <laughs> Take the op. 360. <laughs> Why do you own a car 98? Counter-Strike Global Offensive in 2022? Fucking cringe. <laughs> CSGO has always been a Counter-terrorists win. CSGO is hard. Oh, oh my God. God. Jesus. There's no game that I've ever played that kicks me in the face harder than CSGO. Oh <laughs> I saw the top of someone's forehead. And it always kind of bothered me. Like, of all the games I've played in my 29 years on this earth, why is Counter-Strike the only one that I can't crack? Why do I always feel so new? Why do I always feel so green? It's fine. It's fine. It doesn't bother me. It bothers me a lot. It bothers me a lot. And that one's still green. And that one's still green. Don't get the impression that I'm cracking keyboards and throwing mice around my room just because I'm a shitter at CS because of all the emotions I have towards the game. Anger is not one of them. Don't care. Didn't ask. Cry about it. Stay mad. Get real. L mold seed cope <laughs> curiosity is the main emotion that i'm feeling why are other players so damn good why am i so damn bad and what would it take for me to be a passable counter-strike player all i wanted when i started making this video was one to not have my head explode 15 seconds in every round i flash myself oh god they're right there i got scouted really hard and two to be able to win rounds of competitive while doing dumb shit because what's the point of winning if it isn't any fun Oh, no, yeah. we're zeusing it. We, you know we're zeusing it. <laughs> no, don't throw me it off, you bitch. God damn it. The fucking brain on you this kid. <laughs> yes, I got it. <laughs> what was that dude doing? To be crystal clear, this is not a guy. I am still fucking trash at CS. I still don't take it seriously, and I will be hard stuck in silver where I belong forever. I have nothing to teach you, but rather something to tell you. And that's the tale of how I started having fun in Counter-Strike. I'm still the shitter that I've always been, but now every time I boot up CS, I feel like a quirked up operator that's goaded with the swouts, and I think that's something to be proud of. Quirked up white boy with a little... <laughs> Quirked up white boy with a little bit of swag busted down sexual style. Is he going with the sauce? And I am so fucking excited to tell you the story of how I got there. Just say swa. Swa. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, technology. Before we start, I spent over 300 hours of my life making this video, so you're gonna shut the fuck up and listen. 300 hours? Man, let me go hit that like button. You know, you deserve it, my boy. Let me talk about my energy drink, Guacamole Gamer Fart 9000, made by my sponsor, Gamer Subs. The only company on the planet so fucking dumb yeah, that they gave me my own flavor. Bruh. Guacamole so Gamer Fart 9000 <laughs> is the final form of energy drink. We're talking 100 milligrams of caffeine per teeny tiny scoop. Sorry that I only have bullets for scale. I'm too rich to carry quarters, and all you fuckers know the size of a 9 millimeter, so shut up. Gamer Fart is incredible. We're talking no spike in your blood sugar, no debilitating crash, and most of all, no feeling like you're headed for a heart attack. Mmm, facts. 
It is sugar-free, tastes like shit. <laughs> oh, wait, no, whoa. It's sugar-free, it tastes great, and for the last time, it's not expensive, you assholes. Tons of you out there are going, eh, I don't wanna spend $36 on a tub when- You know what's crazy? I never took this before I worked out. I always took it just to like drink it. But I'm gonna take it before I work out tomorrow, you know what I'm saying? Get be in this thing, you know? Come on now. Keep your mom away from me this summer. You might have a brother or something. Monsters are only $1.50. Shut the fuck up. I drank monsters for almost 10 years. I know how much they cost. <laughs> Gamer Subs is only $36 for 100 servings, which means 36 cents per scoop. Even if you're double scooping, it's still only 72 cents. So this shit is cheap as dirt. I have two to three scoops every single day for a light boost while I'm working, and I've never felt better. So for the love of God, please buy some. And don't forget, use code BADGER for 10% off. God damn. Now, this story starts with about 7 hours of playtime since 2014, so I wasn't completely clueless about Counter-Strike. I know what an op is, I know what Dust 2 is, I know not to alt have a source game, 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 and I know that CSGO tops out your microphone when you boot it up. Can you do me a favor and just tell me once my mic tops out? Yeah, I think everything sounds okay to me. The problem is, almost all of those 70 hours were spent in casual 10v10, which feels like you're playing inside of a YouTube poop and has absolutely nothing to do with true competitive 5v5 Counter-Strike. No, I'm not even good at Counter-Strike. Dude, I'm gonna lick you. I'm gonna lick you, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> what? Was that in game? Hey, yeah, that fart sound was really first. funny. Can you play it again? <laughs> But like live with <laughs> so step one was exclusively playing 5v5 competitive to experience true Counter-Strike and start learning how this shit works. And you CS veterans can probably guess how that went. <laughs> oh, <it's funny. laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Flashing, backing up. I did 95 and 5, dude. Are you kidding me? Oh, what? I He's think the map washed. might be CT side. Shut up, fucking ratio. <laughs> ah! Oh, God. Jesus. Jesus. Stage, right? There's no chance. <laughs> right. Oh, <laughs> my God. That's hilarious. <laughs> Look at these fucking wiggling on it. <laughs> Yo, imagine if they actually... And listen, this is coming hopefully not in my lifetime. But they building some super soldiers that are going to be like uh, robotically... Uh, Controlled or remote controlled CSGO players are getting hired by the government, bro. I'm telling you. <laughs> Repeatedly getting you. your head blown off may not sound like fun, but I learned more in those five hours of competitive than I did in 70 hours of casual. <laughs> and thankfully, my buddies that do play CS like Jello were able to carry my sorry ass. I really don't know how he pulls this shit off with a crosshair that fucking disgusting. <laughs> Yellow, what am I what looking the at? Fuck? A lot of people use it. Man. I don't believe you. That's stupid. That's stupid. It keeps the balance up. See? Pasta, why do you laugh Watch like them. a fucking hyena? <laughs> Stop, you're only proving my point. Pasta's laughing like Krusty the fucking clown. This is Dr. Rockstar! No. I'm just okay! Yo, I don't wanna, I don't wanna fucking... On day two, I was fully expecting to get my nuts crushed by silvers again, which is why I watched some beginner guides on YouTube, and without fail, they all say the same shit. Lower your sensitivity, stop moving when you shoot. And I was like, what the fuck? That's it? That can't possibly work. Struggling. Fuck, who is this? Yes. Double headshot. Uh, Damn. Hello? Yes. Okay. Oh, no. Ace, 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 Let's ace. Let's get it, let's get it, let's get it. Ooh. Yes, the Holy ace. What the man. fuck? W what advice. The... All right, W advice. That's all I had to do this entire time was lower my sense and stop moving? None of you assholes on Twitch could spare 10 seconds out of your dipshit day to tell me that? <laughs> now I officially know what it feels like to be Counter Strike globally offended. Whatever, whatever, I'm over it. And with this newfound knowledge firmly planted in my lizard brain to stop fucking moving, you wiggly <laughs> piece of shit. The next step of the plan, master the hard weapons. Because if I can ball out with the most unforgiving guns in the game, all the rest the of them will feel easy, easy by comparison. Enter the Desert w Eagle. Watch. What I would consider to be the most punishing pistol in the game if your technique is sloppy, which made it the perfect tool to fast track my pistol game. 
All I had to do was stop fucking moving and click on heads. The Desert Eagle Chambered in 50 Action Express was gonna take care of the rest. What the fuck <laughs> map is this? Oh, oh my god. I'm not moving. I, I refuse to move. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? What the fuck? Hang on, hang on. Hang on. Good Watch shot. Stop fucking counting, you idiot. Oh, no, so bitch. Bitch. Yeah, yeah, don't crazy. get scammed, fucking moron. He made it harder. Oh, oh my god. god. Dead. Oh, that was so satisfying. This was a major breakthrough because I was learning the ranges where you can rapid fire and ranges where you have to take it one bullet at a time. <laughs> Clicking on heads is great, but learning that you can achieve similar results just by mag dumping the motherfucker at closer ranges was a huge leap forward for me. The way he was hitting those headshots, bro, I know your Xbox 360 bio said snipers get more heads. Yes. Uh, you look like just enough oh, XP heavenly. <laughs> Fuck you. Oh Ooh, I'm, just... Oh, oh, oh. I'm just guessing right now because I can't Ow. see. Oh, man, try to crouch. Okay, hot one to the net. 3v1. All y'all just snapped it, you know? <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Me. Oh, my God. Yeah, that's <laughs> God his ass. Don't worry about it. Cut He's dead. And finally, landing some deagle shots meant I finally had some money for the next part of the plan. The AK. If there is one weapon that has been the icon of how much I suck some off at CSGO, it's the AK. I swear to you, it sits in my brain like one of those math questions from high school you know you're never gonna understand. You just accept you're too dumb to get how it works and move on. Until now, because I figured if I can succeed with an AK in my hands, it will not only make using every other weapon a picnic, but it will mean that I'm finally not a shitter at CSGO. That is pristine! All I had to do was stand still and fire 7.62 by 39. Is it really that hard? Got him! The only oh, call I would use is Holy over there, shit, behind you, and look out, and bruh. <laughs> And br br <laughs> yeah. right. Ooh, that was nutty. Took his head right off. I'm watching, I'm watching under. No! He's right there. I'm, not... I'm going A. Yeah. No, Ooh, baby, nice. I'm nuts. His buddy's gonna pick me. This, get, this gun don't look that hard, though. Nice. Yeah, that's yeah, yeah. like the, the most mundane AK shots you've ever seen in your life, but I think they're the tightest shit ever. <laughs> And just like the Deagle, the plan of tackling the hardest fucking weapon I could get my hands on totally worked. Now that I understood the unforgiving mechanics of moving and shooting with the AK, every other weapon that landed in my hands seemed like a breeze to use. Sim Nothing made this clearer than running the P90 and MAC-10, because if you're running and shooting with the AK, you're not hitting shit. If you're running and shooting with an SMG, you're probably gonna bulldoze the enemy team, not just because you're spitting out bullets, but because you're so fucking hard to hit. I'll just get a big <laughs> speed of light. Oh, both of them are in there. Both of them. Both of them. Yeah. With your bullets. Yes, yeah. 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 there you go. <laughs> Finally, that worked out. ATF, <laughs> Mako. <laughs> Yeah, speed of sound. Utility was my next big breakthrough. And I'm not talking perfect flashbangs. I'm not talking clutch molotovs. I'm not even talking about talking smoke about? grenades. These CSGO quarterbacks throw. My man looked like he got a freaking shower cap on with some dreads under it. I ain't gonna lie. Throw into outer space and somehow land in the exact right spot. <laughs> I'm just talking about keeping each grenade on a separate keybind. Like, once I cut out the scroll wheel approach and put frag, flash, smoke, molly, and of course, decoy on separate keys, I always pulled out the right one. My nade game is still trash, but at least now I'm throwing a flashbang when I want to throw a flashbang instead of smacking someone in the face with a liquor bottle. Ah, shit! <laughs> Son of a bitch! Oh, good lord. Uh oh, <laughs> what? Right what? That good. <laughs> Flash out. Oh, my mother. Okay, That's it. A clock is all I need, buddy. A, they a don't clock is all I fucking need. <laughs> you gotta know that. Like, see go players? A lot of them hate fun. So, dynamic crossers are big no no. Got gotcha. you. Flash back. Nice. Bobby. Bobby. Double nice. I bought get the kit for a reason, get it, get bitch. It, get it. <laughs> Peter, I can't rush B. I'm handicapped. Uh, oh, oh, run over. My man ran through smoke, through the fire pit. Boy, ain't no uh, <laughs> I got wall bang. What the fuck? I knew 
I was firing on all cylinders when I had the confidence to start using the Zeus. Don't ask me what? why a weapon that's supposed to be non-lethal is a one-shot insta-kill in CS. I'm just here to laugh at the funny man scream. Ah! I missed. Yes, oh. I was feeling it. That was bullseye. You've already missed. Ah! Yes, I got him with the Zeus, baby. Oh, go. man. I got him right in the fucking Killing people neck. with a taste was nuts. Oh, he's got a Zeus behind him. Ah, I got him. <laughs> I didn't mean to make that sound. I was just copying the game. Right? He's got a Zeus Zeus. behind you. I have a Zeus behind you. Don't care. Didn't ask. Plus, you're not Zeus. Yeah, baby. Nice. Yeah. Oh, he had his out. Got him, yeah. <laughs> he was not looking at me at all. And once I could Deagle, AK, Flash, and Zeus at a non-shitter level, it was time to become goaded with the swouts, which meant one, putting on a static crosshair. Triple six, fuck, boom. Oh, no, what you thought? I'm waiting for this opera to come peek us. He's half. Yes, oh. I got him. That's what I wanted. If you want to believe that's what happened here. Look at that. Oh, I'm nuts. Look at that. I'm fucking nuts. I think it's on top of us. Got him. Got you. For a Nice. I don't even nice. know how to and two, some of these people, unboxing bro. a knife. I truly did not care how many cases it was going to take. I was unboxing a knife. I do not care how many it takes. I am opening cases until I get a fucking knife. But after unboxing 440 danger zone crates, as in 440, Valve shut me down with a 72-hour ban after I spent over $1,000 without unboxing. Valve, what are you doing? Giving out bans for buying crates, bruh? Sing a single knife. Bruh, bruh, <laughs> bruh. Bruh. It was all right though, because the homie Kevbo over on Twitch let me borrow his crazy expensive paracord knife that seemed to slice people open just fine. Yes, got him, got him. Yeah, oh, baby, way wow. to go, way to go. And I was so quirked up doing dumb shit with my friends that the 72 hour ban on buying anything flew by like it never had. I'm actually not sure if the three day ban was short or my buddies and I were throwing so many fucking flashbangs every round that I can't remember half of it. <laughs> Wait, what was I saying? Give me all the flash grenades more flashes, you more have. Flashbang. Flashbang. Get it. <laughs> That's What's bullying. my man doing just standing there? That is bullying. <laughs> flash? Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> That's the entire oh fucking god. kill feed. That's the entire <laughs> chat box. We got him, Clue. Off this, you fucking prick. <laughs> so, so many you flashes, bro. Up. <laughs> we just didn't have- Bro, listen, this is literally how people be throwing grenades and tomahawks in Nuketown, bro. Soon as the round starts. I have no flashes that round. <laughs> Everybody saw it off mid, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna open up mid door. I want every flashbang right through there. Right? All your flashbang through it. <laughs> oh, <laughs> God damn. And not a single flash went through the whole one mile. Oh, y'all ain't playing a carnival game in your life. I ain't never taking y'all to King's Dominion, Six Flags. I need you to put one ball in the hole. And you couldn't let shit. Y'all the time to put $50 down for that stuffed animal. Huh? Come to think of it, the only thing I do remember about that 72 hour period was Skulker gaining the ability to speak both forwards and backwards on his soundboard. Technology. So I was. <laughs> you suck that fart back up in your ass. That's crazy. <laughs> Don't do that again. Don't do that again. Bruh. Why are you like this? Why is why is it reversed? <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? What feature is God damn. God damn. It was quite clear that those of you on Twitch were tired of hearing his mic spam as soon as you heard it for the first time. If I see another swouse, I will fucking fire my car at 98k into oncoming traffic. <laughs> Why do you own a car 98? But like I said, the 72 hour ban went by so quickly that there was no need to fire a car 98k into oncoming traffic. After three whole days of waiting, it was finally time to roll the dice again. 
I was not feeling optimistic about my chances at a knife because to jog your memory, I opened 440 crates yeah, over the span of again. three straight hours on Sunday and did not get a knife. That shit is fucking trash, dog. Get the fuck. So it's safe to say train. that when I started the case opening stream on Wednesday, I thought I was going to be up all night. No way. <laughs> First one. You've got Case Harden Shadow Dog. <laughs> this was like five <laughs> minutes of opening. That's How the crazy. fuck do I go 400 and. They, they got the word. They programmed that joint in there, boy. They said, look, with the Russian project, you know what I'm saying? We banned it for 72 hours. Next time you come back, let's give him what he asked for. 40 and not get one. And then this is, that was 19. God, those look awful. <laughs> I know, it's great. <laughs> lightly shitted daggers. I don't even know if you can call those lightly. Those are just shitted. <laughs> and in typical CSGO fashion, even the lightly shitted shadow daggers had a learning curve. Oh, damn. Oh? Oh, you oh. gotta switch, switch, stab. Damn it! Fuck, man. I knew that stabbing did more damage than slicing, but I had no idea that stabbing had a shorter range. And what the fuck is this swish swish stab ultra combo anyway? It's fine. It's fine. I learned my lesson the very next round and was poking everybody with my lightly shitted shadow daggers all night after that. Oh, look, if you go up to a wall, you right click it, you don't hit it. If you left click it, you do. Okay. I am picking. Yes, I got him with it just oh, when yeah. you say that. Oh my god, he gave me his off too. Just when you're schooling me on Switch Switch Snap. <laughs> I just chuck it into his neck. That flash. Oh. Oh, oh, you, you oh you're peeking along with an off on ramp. Get him, guys. Yes, sure got him with the I butt plugs. That's Whoa. all I wanted. Oh my gosh. With the oh, 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 shit. <laughs> Oh, I ran out of blood. Yes! Both of with the butt oh, plug. Yeah, yeah nice. baby. Buy more gamers. <laughs> you son of a bitch. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> I was so you better, excited you better I had to do it. You better start running, I will admit. You better start running. You better start I was running fully cognizant and aware of what I was doing. Running. This was running. not an accident. With my organically sourced shadow daggers figured out, it was time to expand my CSGO repertoire by using the only weapon more difficult than the Deagle, the R8 revolver. My buddies all love the precision of the left click, but I don't play that shit. If there's a loose end that needs to be tied up, I'm fanning that bitch until it takes someone's head off Arizona Ranger style. <laughs> Nutty. I'm just gonna fan around this corner. <laughs> oh, bummer. Bummer. I'm going back. I bought this for a reason, fucker. Yes! Yes! It worked, baby! Cash money! Oh my god. My oh fan my worked, yes! I know at this point, plenty of you are pulling your hair out because it's this late in a CSGO video and I still haven't mentioned the op, but I have a confession to make. I don't really like the op. I'm not saying I'm what too good that? for it, and I'm definitely not saying not it's ineffective because it's crazy powerful, even in the hands of a shitter like me. Oh, God. Oh. There you go. It just feels like a goofy ass point click adventure game. Like, am I playing Pajama Sam or CSGO? And why would I fuck around with an op every round when I just blew 300 bucks on a factory new stat track M4 Hyper Beast off a guy from Ohio named Skylar Hates Alice that clearly likes anime? <laughs> because at this point, I was un. Undoubtedly busting it down sexual style, but I couldn't be goaded with the swaps until I had a hyper beast. E Cash wasn't too happy about me spending that kind of money on a factory new skin when I just opened a brand new knife, but who cares what he thinks? I'm the one holding the hyper beast. Like you motherfuckers. What? I just bought it outright. I got money. Killed one. Got one. My first Dude, kill with the hyper beast. Lazy. We goaded it with the sauce or without with the sauce. Now, Tucker, it's terrible they're saying the white boy's not good with the sauce. I've seen him firstly. Who wants to hold the hyper beast next? <laughs> <laughs> I do, I do. Why are you doing that to my rifle? My rifle. Mom said it's my turn on the hyper beast. I found this on the guy that I shot at Badger's hyper beast through once. <laughs> <laughs> Why is oh, yeah. everyone carrying bag. my hyper beast? The only thing more satisfying than finally owning a hyper beast was finally figuring out which maps are god tier and which maps should be outright deleted. 
In my opinion, the single most important factor as to whether or not I'd have fun in a game was the map we picked, because I don't care how sunshine and rainbows positive you are, if you play some shit like Vertigo, you're gonna get smashed by people that only play Vertigo. These dudes are uh, so, not here to play games. They're here to win. Honey, we're all here for Thanksgiving dinner. Why don't you tell the family about your favorite smoke spots on Vertigo? <laughs> But if you pick some shit like Nuke, you're guaranteed to have a blast no matter who the other team is. It's Shout out Bronze J for turning it. Nuke into a complete fucking circus, by the way. I remember it as a nightmare map back in the day, and now it's a non-stop clown parade where every round is filled with such horse shit that it's always fun. Someone's behind me! Oh my god, I'm sorry. God! Oh, I Yo, that's the second moment of this video, Badger, alright? You're done. I love pickup! Pickup is fucking right. tight! Oh my god, I whipped it. Yes, was, it worked! That yeah. pickup! Your cat what? stole uh, your radiator? How does a cat steal a radiator? <laughs> this Definitely? cat goofy uh, as hell. What the hell? No, bro, he do, do be it. certified in H. <laughs> you going what to heaven, doing? big boy. What? What? Play your soundboard. Do the soundboard. <laughs> Come then. Oh, what? <laughs> What timeline are we? Uh, uh, what am I, dog? Oh my god, I cannot breathe. I cannot breathe. The only map that comes close is Office, which feels more like a Gmod prop hunt map than a Counter-Strike map, but we play it more like Gmod anyway, so I guess that checks out. Imagine <laughs> Boy, listen, I seen this. It's like, hold on, what is that? Now I got questions. Uh, what? <laughs> Paul. Duh! Walker. <laughs> Eric. I feel like I'm ding dong ditching. <laughs> oh my mm. god! Okay, two of us are up here. God help if they swing this corner. <laughs> oh my <laughs> god! Oh, I'm nuts! We have to go, okay. Yo, they put his brains in the break room, bro. You're done. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, there you go. I don't think this other team just know what hit them. Bob! 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 He hit a clip! He hit a clip, bro! <laughs> what just fell over? Oh, this oh, is a scary up. peak. Oh my god. Just don't move. Do not move your feet. Because then we're going to TK. Facts. Okay. I am <laughs> fucking dead. <laughs> <laughs> that second guy got laid out. Imagine turning the corner of three AKs and an off standing in a fucking cheerleader pyramid. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Colette, baby. Oh, excuse me. Oh, I almost took your head off. Wait, we're doing. Oh, I got him. Even if Office isn't your thing, Mirage is good, Cash is good, Inferno is good. I don't play Inferno because all of my dipshit friends care more about chicken kills than regular kills. But my point remains there's plenty of good maps out there. All right, most chickens killed. Let me see it. Yes! The Colonel, bitch! <laughs> what? <laughs> what? I told you! I told you! You're gonna hate me for saying Dust 2 is great, deli. but it's great. When I finally managed to clutch you out on a team that was clearly better than us on Dust 2. Bro, you can't tell me that's not an army bonnet, bro. I'm convinced. Two, with an AK in my hands, it truly felt like I was no longer a shitter at CSGO. You can call me a dipshit silver, you can nitpick any detail of this video you want, but this round finally made me feel like I was playing Counter-Strike, and finally made me feel goaded with the swaps. Fine. Got him. Oh my god. <laughs> Calvin was in front of my shot, Mickey flashed the whole team. Cause I thought you were going to- I saw you pushing over to mid, so you check it. I was gonna push the car. Boy. Nice. nice. I should have just slow him down. Nice, you're right. Yes! Nice. Fuck nice. stopping oh, while my you God. clutch. How does he do it? And that's the story of how I became goaded with the swaps in CSGO. If there's one lesson that I've learned, it's that you need to play Counter Strike to enjoy Counter Strike. Let's roll. Like, fuck, I spent well over 600 hours making this video, three quarters of which was just shit posting in the Source engine, and I'm still not tired of Counter Strike, so do yourself a favor and play CSGO. Yo, Which? why do you have an Amogus on your back, Calvin? Uh, I do? What the hell?
Uh, me when Rocks. I slap your ass? You're caught. <laughs> Plus, I slap your ass. How dare you say that to me, Gross, and I'm a Reddit gold user. Oh, what the fuck? You deserve more now. That just woke me out of my nap, bro. That brought me to reality. That activated my fight or flight response. Turn that bullshit channel off, bro. I'm trying to go back to bed. If I'm understanding this correctly, your name is Tardo the Ass Monkey? Yes, that would be I. Booger, why is the very hungry caterpillar dead after a combination of malnutrition and blunt force trauma? Blunt force trauma to the head is what killed the very hungry caterpillar. Yeah. And that's about it, dog. It's time for me to CS go. Shout out to you guys for patiently waiting this long for this hey, goddamn wait, video. Wait, I'm say, pretty sure I spent hours? so much time in SFM that 25% of my brain is now rendered in source. If you could do me a huge favor and buy some fucking gamer fart and use code badger, it would mean so much to me. Because just taking two months off to make a video like this, it is not good for my money situation. So if you could just buy some fucking gamer fart, it would just be so much better for me. Yeah, the way that I make videos is just not good because of all the demonetization and age restrictions so if you could do that yo they be man, doing my man filthy come on youtube gotta do better for man. me just buy some gamer subs i would really appreciate it thank you a final thank you for watching and again waiting this long for the video and be sure to tune in next time when i soundproof this motherfucking room <laughs> okay uh-huh big holla in the building a better sub to him Bars. All right, listen, y'all like, comment, subscribe. You know what I'm saying? Look, I'm never playing CSGO. This game look way too hard for me. I know I'm going to be raging, put holes in my wall. All right, mad keyboards punched out. Uh, you know, I'm a DDT, my, my, my uh, monitor. I don't want to do that, bro. This game look too hard. Now, the 10v10, they said it's a lot less hard. Might try that, but I don't know. But y'all like, comment, subscribe, all that great stuff. Until the next time I see y'all. Yeah, nigga, I was broke. I ain't have a penny. I was ready, kick a dope. Lay your ass on the floor. Taking everything about this bitch before I go. Niggas talking all that gang gang when the sugar pumping through their main vein. Swerve on them like a lane change. Fuck with youngin' cause we on the same thing. Granny died, it was caught at the fire.